Okay, so let's add some shapes to a pie chart slide just to support the pie chart a little bit. So we're going to go up to the top of the ribbon and select the insert tab. We're going to insert something from shapes and uh, we're going to select arrow right. Okay, so now I've got, I've got that uh, ready to insert. So I'm just going to click in the general direction of somewhere where I'd like it to be. Okay, good. So there's my, um, th th there's my arrow in inserted. I'm just going to uh, resize it a little. I'm just going to just use my cursor just to get hold of one of these grab handles. So grab one of those uh, those little balls and then pull it until it's the right shape. So I can just tweak that a little bit and just get it uh, just get it just right. Okay, so now I'd like to just reposition this shape just so it's uh, aligned a little better with the pie chart. I'm just going to click in there. I'm going to grab it and then I can just pull it around. Now, you can see that PowerPoint is helping, helping me out a little. When it's uh, properly aligned, you can see that little red dotted line appears. So I know that's exactly in the right place. So I'm just going to release it now. And there, my, uh, my arrow is the right size. And now it's lined up correctly with my pie chart. So what I'm going to do now is add some text to uh, to this arrow just to just to give some supporting text just to explain what it is. So I'm just going to click in there and then I can just start typing. Okay, so I'm just going to click away from there now and I'm happy with uh, with the way that looks. I'd like to add another arrow now onto the other side. So I'm just going to quickly uh, add this now. So let's choose a left arrow this time. Okay, so I've got my text, and this time the, uh, the the font is a little different. So I'm just going to double check on the left hand arrow what we've got. So if I just click on this text here, I can see by looking on the ribbon that it is a Calibri, uh, Calibri style font and size 18. So let's have a look at what we've got over here. Okay, so that's smaller. So what I'd actually like to do, I think, is use the format painter. So I, I, I click in here. So I want to. I want to kind of copy the format of this text. So I've highlighted a little bit of text. I go up to the ribbon, click on Format Painter. So that's selected. I'm now going to go to the text on the uh, on the other arrow, highlight it all, release it, and then you can see that the uh, that, that that text is now um, is now the same style. I'm just going to pop this down a little bit. Okay, good. So. There's a few little changes, and I'm happy with how uh, how that's looking now. Okay, so what I'd like to do now is just change the the, the fill color of the arrow on the left hand side, just so it ties in a little better with the colors on the pie chart. So I'm going to click on the uh, arrow, right click. Then we have some options. One of them at the top is is the fill color. So we click on here, and now we can select uh, some alternative colors. And you can see the way it changes on the fly, so you can see how it's going to look instantly. I'm going to choose the same orange as the pie. I'm going to click on there. The other thing I'd like to do is change the outline color here. You can see it's a different color to, to the actual content. So we're just going to uh, just right click again, click on outline, um, and then we're going to just give it uh, the same the same orange but a slightly different shade. So I just want to go a little tiny bit darker. I find that uh, uh, an outline that is like one shade darker than the content, that always looks pretty good. So let's go ahead and click that. Okay, good. And we can see the way that ties in nicely now. 